Hi, my name is Mark, and I'm the Animal Care Director and Educator for Natural World Education. This is today's Naturalist Minute. Today, we're going to focus on everyday trees you might find planted in your backyard. Oaks are common trees you'll find planted on municipal streets because they grow straight, tall, and make excellent shade trees. Oaks are deciduous, which means that their leaves turn red and yellow and fall off in the fall. Oak trees produce acorns, which are an important source of nutrition and food for squirrels, deer, and other wildlife. There are two groups of oak trees. There's the red oaks, and then there's the white oaks. Red oak trees, like this one right here, produce acorns with more tannins in them that are very difficult to digest. White oaks are the kind of acorns that you can eat. Red oak acorns are eaten by squirrels though, and what they'll do is they'll store the red oak acorns in the ground for the winter and then eat all the white oak acorns right away. That's because red oak acorns with their higher tannin amount are less likely to rot than the white oak acorns. This red oak is a water oak, Quercus nigra. It is a hardy oak which grows to 50 or 80 feet in height and thrives in moist, wet, and poorly drained soils, which means you can find it growing all over South Georgia. It's very rugged and can survive many harsh conditions. It's native to Georgia and is a favorite larval breeding ground for hair streak butterflies. You can tell a water oak by the shape of its leaves. If you look right here at this one, you'll see it has an ice cream cone shape, we say. Another thing we say about red oak trees is that none of the leaves on one tree, will, no two leaves will look the same. So it's another way you can tell a water oak's uh, leaves. Thank you very much. That's been today's Naturalist Minute.